Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we're doing a reading for sign of Libra and can you find that this will not resonate for every Libra? So let's see what we have for the sign of Libra. We have nature spirits. All right, so we're connecting with nature spirits here. Spirit keeper of the West. Eagle Medicine. We have Elder. Alright, so let's have a look at your cards here, Libra. Starting with Eagle Medicine. The found connection to the Creator. And the heavenly realms are the next, yeah. So that is what eagle represents, is it represents great spirit or God. All right. You see an eagle, you have that, hev you have that connection to the creator and the heavenly realms. As the eagle soars high above the earth, has the ability to see things from a higher perspective, courage and stamina are filling your life. You have the ferocity to right injustice and wrongs done to you or others. All right. This is a time to face fear and overcome it. It says, if the Eagle Medicine card has chosen you, you are at the advent of the opportunity to truly see life from a rarefied vantage point. So this is all, like, isn't all of you getting a different viewpoint, getting a higher perspective of a situation? Eagles are considered one of the most sacred of all birds in many tribes and cultures. Their single-minded fierceness, dynamic energy, and ability to soar high are part of the reason for this. This card reminds you to take heart and face fear. You do indeed have the strength to overcome any adversities. You can overcome anything that comes your way. I feel like it has to do with you getting a higher perspective here. And you can have like God in the heavenly realms. All right, Libra. You also have direct line to the creator. Your prayers are heard and will be answered in accordance with your highest good. So your prayers have been heard, Libra, and they will be answered. What have you prayed for here? You have the capacity to channel extraordinary life force energy through your hands. We have Elder. Confidence entering your power. Standing strong, you are a leader. Stepping into the light. Okay, look at this. You're, you're really stepping into your power here, Libra. As you've got a different grip, yeah, viewpoint, like the eagle. Let your truth be heard and felt by others. Make a stand in your life. You carry deep inner wisdom. You are a teacher and a leader. So you're a leader and a teacher, Libra. In the deepest sense of the words, you are a beacon for others. In Native cultures, the elders, tribal chiefs, and clan leaders are looked to for advice and leadership. When this card chooses you, it's time to step up into your leadership role. Another walks down the path, stomps the grass down, and throws the boulders out of the way, so the path is easier for others. Sometimes you might find yourself alone or tired, but know that what you're doing is making a difference in the lives of many. The greatest leaders are those who know how to serve, supporting others to reach their dreams. Even if you've been in the background in the past, right now it's your time to step forward and become a light for others. So you're, light, you're like a light, a beacon for others, all right? You're a teacher, you're a leader. You're guiding people here, you're guiding people towards spirit. nature spirits joy delight peaks of carefree abandon living wildly magically and free be open to the wonders of the universe flooding into your life innocence and delight are abounding happiness is on the way so there's overall happiness here as you got a different viewpoint as you're overcoming obstacles as you're connecting with god in the heavenly realms here all right Almost every indigenous culture recounts the stories of fairies, often called little people, and nature spirits. Although some of the fairies act in protection of their wild lands and should be treated with care and respect, most often they bring blessings and delights into all in their realm. But this nature spirits card chooses you. And welcome to a wellspring 
of joy in magic. Beneath the surface, mystical interventions are occurring in your life. Relax all as well. Okay. Spirit Keeper of the West. Transformation, letting go of the old. Initiation, illumination. Harvest, gathering your resources. If it doesn't feel right, don't go ahead. All right, so you can have a higher perspective using your intuition as well. If it doesn't feel right, don't go ahead. All right, letting go of the old. There's, there's a, I want to say horses. I don't know why I almost said that, but harvest. Trust your heart. Chaos brings positive change. Almost all change comes out of turmoil. Don't be concerned if there's confusion in your life. It'll all work out. It's going to all work out. Relax. All is well. And the medicine wheel. The west is a direction that symbolizes the fiery setting sun. Autumn. The waning moon in the time of harvest. And the years of teenagers in human, human cycle. Out of the chaos arise illumination and transformation. In order for the new to ignite in your life, it's necessary to let go of the old. Sweep away the debris. Spirit Keeper of the West reminds us to slow down our rapid growth and harvest what we have attained. In autumn, leaves are burned away to make for new growth. At least to draw us new life to make way for new growth. Okay? So, Libra, that is the message for you. It's a time of harvest connected with nature. Spirit's connected with great spirit here, connected with the heavenly realms. You're leading people. You're Teaching people here feels like there's joy, there's abundance. Your prayer has been answered, and you're getting a different viewpoint. Let's get some room, some charge yourself. So we have Cancer, the zodiac sign. So if you have those placements in your chart or one around you, we have Hathor, the Chinese zodiac sign of the monkey. If Serpent's Bay, which is the center master of light, which you're all connecting to, you have an opening, there's protection, Libra. There's flow, and there's movement. Alright, so, that's all I have for you. If you want to see more content, like, subscribe. Bye, guys.